and welcome to Camp Nou, where on Monday evening, Football Club Barcelona took on Real Madrid in the 160th Classic between these two great giants of European football. And, of course, the two teams that have dominated Spanish football over the years uh, certainly are dominating the Spanish league this season, Real Madrid. Top of the table coming into the clashing camp now on 32 points. Barcelona just one behind. The two managers, Pep Guardiola, looking to continue his 100% record against Real Madrid. Four games and four victories since he became coach in 2008. Real Madrid coach Jose Mourinho taking on football club Barcelona for the first time as Real Madrid manager. As ever, tremendous build-up to the game. The game being played on Monday for the third time in the history of Spanish football. Just to make it that extra bit special. The two teams, Barca with their strongest 11, with only Gabi Melito missing through injury. Guardiola put out Victor Valdez, who was in the wars early on. Clashing with Gerard Piquet, but he was soon on his feet and fine. At the back, Eric Abidal, Puyol, Piquet and Dani Alves in midfield. Xavi Iniesta and Sergio Busquets. And up front, Davi Villa, Leo Messi and Pedro. Jose Mourinho forced into one change from his usual starting 11. Gonzalo, Gonzalo Higuaín, rather. Had a slight injury problem. He was left on the bench and in came Karim Benzema. Master pressured early on. Leo Messi almost opening the scoring after five minutes. The ball coming back off the post with Iker Casillas beaten. It would have been a dream star for Barca in this 160th meeting between the two sides. Long range effort from Dani Alves. Early booze for Cristiano Ronaldo. A touch for Angel Di Maria, trying to squeeze the ball through to Benzema. Both teams in excellent form coming into this game. Both recorded five consecutive victories before Monday's Classic. And it was Barca who took the lead, Xavi Hernández picking out a fantastic pass from Andres Iniesta. The ball bobbing up off his heel. But he was quick to react and dinked a lovely finish with the unrushing Ica Casillas. Reactions from the sidelines in the Reina camp now. Pep Guardiola and Jose Mourinho watching intently. And there, Guardiola's reaction says it all. Barca 1 0 up. Delight for the fans. Mourinho urging his side on. Trying to come back from this early setback. Here, Xavi clearly on side. Marcelo, the last ditch attempt to intercept Iniesta's pass. Once again, we can see the finish. Casillas claiming for offside. Xavi clearly onside when Iniesta made the pass. Madrid trying to strike back almost immediately. Angel Di Maria bringing a good save from Victor Valdez. Di Maria shot, taking a slight deflection of Dani Alves. Barca attempting to counter quickly from the corner. Madrid, dangerous as ever on the counter-attack. Their most dangerous weapon, Cristiano Ronaldo. Almost finding Benzema with a good through ball, but Eric Abidal and Victor Valdez combined to clear the danger for Barca. Benzema trying to get behind French fullback Abidal. David Villa in space on the left-hand side. He ran at Sergio Ramos, Casillas couldn't hold the cross, and Pedro was there to make it 2-0 to Barca after 17 minutes. 
delight in camp now. Villa taking on Sergio Ramos. Casillas failing to hold the cross. And Pedro was there for his third league goal of the season. Beating Marcelo at the far post. And a fantastic start for Barca. 2-0 up with less than 20 minutes played. Looking for a third. Good interception from Pepe. Also dominating, dominating possession. Pedro taking on Marcelo. A good cross in. And it was Sergio Ramos who put the ball behind for a corner. Casillas urging his defence to get themselves organised. It was difficult to do. And Barca playing so fluently. Once again, Pedro beating the offside trap. And Casillas out to smother the danger quickly. Fortunately, moment passed without too much trouble. Play continued. And then there was a yellow card for David Villa for this challenge on Madrid midfielder Kadira. That presented a chance for Cristiano Ronaldo from the free kick, but the ball flashing just wide. Pico Valdez seemed to have it covered. The Barca wall falling apart somewhat. Still in the first half, chance for Di Maria to get a cross in. Almost gets it in for Mesut Ozil. Carlos Puyol couldn't keep it in. Messi running up the Madrid defence. A shot from distance, not troubling Casillas. Messi once again. Getting Sergio Ramos in possession. Madrid saved by a good challenge by Pepe. Busquets standing on the ball. Caught in midfield by Xavi Alonso. Chance again for Cristiano Ronaldo with that shot straight down the throat of Victor Valdez. As the game approached half time. Didn't really seem to make much difference though at the start of the second half. Barca continue where they left off in the first. Almost a chance for Xavi, and then it was Villa. Messi threading the ball through again to Xavi. This time the side netting. It was the second of the evening for the midfielder. Good challenge from Kadira getting back. Prevent Xavi from getting a shot in. The first time. And the second time, the angle too tight. The goal soon came though. Villa getting in behind Pepe. Great ball from Leo Messi. Great finish from David Villa. Seventh league goal of the season. And Barca 3 0 up. Just 10 minutes into the second half. Blaugrana's dominance complete. Messi. Threading the ball in behind Pepe. One touch to control. A right foot shot from Villa. Casillas with no chance. And Barca's fluid. Attractive football. Continuing to provide its rewards for the Blaugranas. Messi again. Madrid unable to get him off the ball. Fantastic ball this time in behind Sergio Ramos and Villa once again. First time finish. Pas Casillas. Two goals in three minutes for David Villa. Barca 4 0 up. Before we even reach the hour mark and camp now. And really, Leo Messi not on the score sheet but pulling the strings. Fantastic through ball. Great finish from Villa. And Madrid really down and out in Barcelona. 
Long range effort from Xavi Alonso, not forcing Vicra Valdez into a save. Sergio Busquets almost catching Ica Casillas off guard. Busquets with the confidence to try and catch out the Madrid keeper. Again, Barca getting in behind the Real Madrid defence, but Bojan just stumbling at the wrong minute. Bojan, second half substitute, he'd come on to replace David Villa. Again, chance for Bojan, his stinging drive batted away by Casillas. Good ball from Havid out. Another substitute, Jeffren. Jeffren putting the ball across the Real Madrid penalty area. Into injury time. Passer looking for a fifth. Cross from Boyan. And the fifth came courtesy of Jeffren. The two substitutes combining to add a fifth for Football Club Barcelona. The humiliation complete for Real Madrid. Jeffren onside when Boyan's cross came in. Iniesta couldn't quite get there, but Jeffren could. Casillas left exposed once again. <laughs> Referee Iturralde with the final whistle. Victory for Football Club Barcelona. And not just any victory, but a memorable 5-0 victory. Guardiola's Barca team repeating the feat pulled off by Johan Cruyff's great side in the 70s. And of course, the dream team in January 1994, also managing to put five unanswered goals past Real Madrid at home in Camp Nou. And on Monday, it was Josep Guardiola's Barca team who equaled that feat 5-0. Goals from Xavi, Pedro, two from David Villa, and in injury time, substitute Jeffren rounding off the victory. The final score, FC Barcelona 5, Real Madrid 0.